Hi, yes, uh, my name's Dev Lal. Um, I am an upper GI surgeon, and for many years now, I've been helped, helping doctors to grow their own private practices. Um, and since 2010, I've done that on a full time basis, having left the NHS. So, what were you going to be talking about at the um, Private Healthcare Summit? Okay, well, the title of my talk is really The Doctor in the Driving Seat Consultant driven healthcare and my perspective is this first of all when you work in the NHS you've got two machines really two gargantuan machines helping you do what you do treat patients firstly you've got a machine which helps you provide the healthcare uh, the nursing staff the secretarial staff the operating theaters all the machinery for providing care but what you've also got is a machine to deliver patients to you and when you are in private practice, you don't have that machine. So what I'll be talking about is how to create that machine yourself, how to create um, a stream of patients in your practice that which you have ultimate control of. Uh, and if there's one end goal, if there's one summary that I can offer you that, it's the word sovereignty, where you have power, you have control, and the ability to provide the top-notch healthcare as well as a thriving income in private practice would like. Brilliant. So why is that such a pertinent topic right now? Okay. Um, first of all, there are a number of challenges we currently face in, uh, in, uh, as consultants in private practice. And generating patients is a perennial problem. What's happened now over the last, say, 20 years with the explosion of information, including the internet, means that there's a lot more information available to patients um, about clinicians, about the care that's available. In past times, if a patient wanted to be seen privately, they would simply go to their GP and ask the GP suggestion. Now, people are able to find out for themselves who is good, who has the required expertise, and will ask their GP for a referral, or will pick up the phone themselves. So that explosion of information that's available to people is something that we as clinicians should take advantage of, should make ourselves visible to, um, and that will help us provide the care we want to to the patients who need our care.